Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Road to the Prem with Macclesfield. And from the last episode, as you can see, we finished in 11th. So in this episode, we're going to do another 10 games and hopefully, well, be higher than 11. I mean, I'd, I'd take about 8th, 9th, 8th place right now. So with that, let's get going. As you can see, we're training our best goalkeeper, two of the strikers and a centre midfield player. So we have a stronger presence in them areas. See if any of them grow. Not a single attribute was actually grown. That is just perfect, is that? The first game we have is against Colchester, which are fourth in the table. So fingers crossed, lads. Come on. Don't let me down. Please. Come on. I don't even know why I chose Macclesfield. I mean, I've got no chance ever. As per usual, training up the same line of players. Trying to get the young ones to the highest rating, obviously. So we can have a longer time with them. Oh, fucking hell. One of them. Oh, two of Three of them. I know. One of them was the same guy, but two different things. But one of them actually went up one overall. And one of them actually grew two traits. Attributes? Traits? I don't have a clue, fam. And the monthly youth reports come in as we look here. Don't know what position. Oh, oh, I didn't realise that. We could use this guy. He's a left, left midfield, right midfield. Depends on which way you look at it, really, doesn't it? And he's got a potential of 66 to 80. Could uh, be worth a scout. Other than that. I mean, this guy can play all over. You know what? Let's sign you and sign you. See where you end up. Yeah, reject them. And the next game is against Cambridge, who's 18th in the league. So if we don't win this time, then my players are just mental lads. And we drew. That's... I mean, we'll take a point. Then we're up against Park Vale, which are fourth in the league, so don't expect too much out of these lot. What the fuck? Hello everyone, whilst I was editing this video, I decided, you know what, I think I should start doing a random fact of the day in my videos, and today's fun fact is, in Switzerland, it is illegal to own only one guinea pig, would you know? When I first saw that, I thought, well, I don't have a guinea pig to begin with, so it doesn't really affect me. Hope you've enjoyed the fun fact of the day, and uh, hope you enjoy the rest of the video. See you later. Today's match is against Oldham, who are the bottom of the league. If we cannot win this, I am done, lads. Nah, fam, I'm done. Hello, it's me again. Uh, just an explanation as to what I'm doing here is... I, I normally cut this out, but I, I always swap the players around so then to keep them happy and so then they don't put in transfer requests, even though some of them I do want to sell. But I do this just to, you know, keep them all happy. Just thought I'd let you know, so then it's not just all me simming games, so... Bye again. And this match is against Cheltenham, which is one place higher than us. Hopefully we can actually win this time. Uh, if we if we do win, then the game's bugged. That's all I'm saying. And we actually win. We can't beat 24th place, but we can beat, what, 12th place, because we're in 13 now. Madness, lads. As for his youth team, we do have somebody who's going to be quite decent I mean two people but they're both the same position which is a bit mad really but this guy is going to be a hell of a lot better than this guy so oh well, he's 66 to 80 he's 62 to 86 potential I think we'll get rid of this guy and we'll actually sign this guy in left midfield oh fuck Oh, you can play left midfield. 
Oh, in that case then. As you can see, we've added another person to the transfer list. This time, Michael Rose. He's 37, so we probably won't actually get an offer, but I'm trying to get the oldies out and get some young blood into the team. Now we're playing 7th place Bradford. Hopefully, once again, we can actually win because we need to get promoted. That's the whole point of this series. And looks like this series is going to go on for a lot longer than we intended to then. And we've changed this session's training up to the young youth player we've assigned. We're going to try and train him up to as high a level as we can. And of course, one of my best strikers I have at the minute. Now we're playing 16th placed Carlisle. I mean, I'm going to say we're going to lose this time. It's a draw, we'll take a point, I guess. Uh, looks like we're playing top of the league Swindon, but instead it's a Emirates FA Cup round. So we're going to lose, because it's top of the league, so we're automatically going to lose. And we didn't have to lose that bad. Now we're playing fifth place Mansfield, and obviously, guys, we all know where this is going to go. We, we, we're just going to lose straight away, aren't we? Oh my god, we won! Lads, get the wine bottles out. We've won a game against a much higher placed team. Oh, looks like the board are happy with us because we're not investing in our youth team. Well, I guess we better go do that some more then. Mm, where should we go? Northern Europe? Maybe not. Let's tell you what, let's, let's go into Brazil and South America. Argentina? No, let's go to Brazil. Let's make it six months and look for any kind of players. And let's get on with the next match against 15th place Salford. Place your bets everyone, who do you think is going to win? If we can beat like 5th place Mac Mansfield, whoever it was, I was going to say Macclesfield then, but that's us. If we can beat 5th place Mansfield, guaranteed we're going to lose against 15th place Salford. They're only two places, two, three places lower than us. Told you, see? See, I can call it. And for the last game of today's episode, we'll be playing against literally the team up, up one from us crew. Alexander. Al Ale Alexandra? Yeah, that's it. Alexandra. Alex no, Alexander. Alexandra. Alexandra. Yeah. So, hopefully we can finish the this episode on a high note. Yes, thank God. We actually ended this episode on a high note. So anyway guys, hope you enjoyed this episode. Leave a like, comment and subscribe. Uh, have a lovely day and I'll see you all in the next one. Hello, post me again. If you do want to see me play the actual games, do please let me know in the comments below. Uh, I just found that it gives the like league more of a synthetic is that, is that the right word feeling if I just didn't play it but if these episodes are getting a bit boring whilst I was editing this I did find it boring so if you do want to see me play the games just let me know and see you later